Hello there, Truth Seekers. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of Roll News Analysis. Today, the once beloved Prince Harry, the beacon of hope and unity, has taken a dark turn, a treacherous path that has led us to question his loyalty, his intentions and his very character. The narrative that unfolds before us is one of deception, betrayal and a sickening disregard for the very institution that nurtured him. But wait, there's more before we unveil the juicy details. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon. So imagine this, a man once hailed as a prince, now accused of the gravest crimes against his own country, against his own family. High treason, a term that sends shivers down the spine, is now being associated with none other than Prince Harry himself. The evidence, it seems, is damning, and it's time we expose the truth that's been hidden behind carefully crafted facades. Let's dissect the accusations, shall we? High treason, a betrayal of the crown and the monarchy, is broken down into three grave offensive. The first, plotting the murder of the sovereign or the heir, a heinous crime that Prince Harry's own words have seemingly confirmed his admission to plotting against his father Prince Charles cast a sinister shadow over his intentions. The second offence, aiding the sovereign's enemies, providing them with crucial information. This is where Harry's alleged actions regarding security plans for Buckingham Palace came into play. His alleged sharing of details, the layout of the palace and the locations of the royal family members is not only a breach of trust, but a potential danger to the safety of the nation. The third offence, attempting to undermine the lawful line of succession, takes a more perplexing turn. Prince Harry claims about his children, children that have remained largely unseen and unheard of, raise significant doubts about his intentions. Are these children mere pawns in a power play, tools used to manipulate the line of succession? The questions loom large and demand answers. And now we come to the reaction. King Charles, finally out of patience, is reportedly showing red flags against his own son. But what does this mean for the future of the monarchy? An emergency meeting has been converted in Parliament and implications are profound. The suggestion of removing all Sussex titles, stripping Harry of a connection to the royal family is on the table. But this story doesn't end with Prince Harry alone. His wife Meghan is a figure whose behaviour raises eyebrows from manipulation to narcissism. Her actions paint a picture of self-serving motives that have no place within the hallowed halls of the monarchy. So what do you guys think about the news? Let us know in the comments and we'll see you next time for more royal news and analysis.